I never heard so much crime coming from the Philadelphia area and for the people across the world who are Boots fans. I ain't never heard so much crime and these excuses that they are making for this guy. It's unbelievable. I thought this was the sport of boxing. I thought if you go in there and you put on a great performance, you put on a great performance. If you put on an okay performance, just say, okay, it wasn't my night. But people are making all these horrendous excuses about uh, Boots and his coach. What's your thoughts? Man, I mean, listen. I mean, again, they 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 holding on. They holding on for dear life. <laughs> they holding on for dear life, but I think they holding on to a sinking boot. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't get it, dog. Like, I don't get it. And again, and and look, you know, I I don't like sharing, you know, our side combos. But I, I told Cray on Saturday. He told me the same thing. Like, I, I haven't been blown away by it. Boots in this yet? I don't see what all the hype is about, and that's not a knock. He's passed the eyeball test and stuff, but to yeah, good fight, to, to to say that you can beat Crawford, and then to say, uh, "Oh, uh, Norman don't deserve a fight," like we're talking about as if he's a legend already, which is crazy to me. 